Alright, another video. Today is August 31st. I'm keeping track now because I'm back in school. Um, yeah, I'm in school. It sucks. But, um, I'm going to do a little pond hopping today. Three main ponds. Uh, try to get some bass. Place called the Kentlands. You guys, if you fish locally, you'll probably know what I'm talking about. Um, but I'll show you the rods I'm bringing. I'm just working this rod. I need to get a new rod for this, but... Oops. Um, let's got a little finesse jig. I'm gonna flip this, punch it through some cover, maybe. Um, here I've just got the Strike Pro swim bait. Um, just, I just I always have it tied on. I'm probably gonna switch off to like maybe a chatter bait or some kind of moving bait. Um, it's got the Senko on my uh, pond hop and Senko stick. Um, no drop shot today. Just got this little thing loaded up. Got the chesty rocking. Um, so I think I'm going to load up the car, uh, Michael's going to come, but Michael's doing Michael stuff, so he's not coming, so I'm doing it alone, but I guess I'll see you guys, maybe when I get there? Alright, yeah, my camera's about to die, oh, look at this lens, sorry about that, so, I'm just going to get all this nonsense loaded up, I still have them wash this. Just because I've been using it so much, but now school started and my dad's going to be soon heading down to the Florida Bahamas area. I'm going to give it a good wash. Oh, and I'm fishing the CBKA tournament. Um, link will be in the description below. I'm going to be fishing it. Um, it's in Stevensville, Maryland. It's on Chesapeake Bay. Um, but I was going to say I need to wax my kayak. Check out some of that smooth wax. Link is below. Um... Yeah, I'm going to be fishing that. I got pre-fish. Maybe this weekend. I don't know, because it's next weekend. Um, not this Saturday, but next Saturday. And, um, yeah, so it's, so yeah, uh, if any of you guys are around this area, I highly suggest the tournament. I haven't fished it before, but maybe I'll get some. There's my elementary school bus. Okay, uh, let's load up the car. After I said it spontaneously dropped off by my mom, um, I'm at the two ponds. I'm gonna think I'm gonna fish the one on the right. Um, my swim bait just got stuck on my bag. Anyways, I'm gonna fish the one on the right. There's a nice outflow. Um, let's see, right here, it's another good one. A little bit. This one's a little bit muddy. I guess because of all the rain we've had. But these are both two decent, solid ponds. So hopefully, I'll find a bot or a pattern today. Get in some fish. All right, there's a lot of weed and stuff here, so it might be a little bit challenging to fish a swim bait. I might break out a frog, but I guess we'll see. See what's popping. All right, let's see what we can't do with this little frog right here. Little jawbone frog I'm down. I don't know how I can tell that, but that is some frog heaven. There's a nice map right there. So I'm gonna fish the swim bait around here a little bit. Cast out towards this fountain. See what's going on out there. But I think I'm in a frog. Or at least attempt to. Maybe try to punch it. Yeah, too much. Alright, I'm making a move. This is not promising at all. So I know I didn't give it that long, but I'm only here for a little time, so I have to capitalize on it. So I'm gonna go to the other spot and see if I can uh, make something happen. All right, made pond number three. Good news is the water is like a weird bluish color, and I actually do. Well, I got stuck, but I do have my chartreuse senko on. So, ask my mother. I'm gonna try to get one. I might have to pull out the chartreuse crankbait. Hello. I'm with the other. Chartreuse Senko did work. Not the right species. Got 
turtle. Oh, you bit on it. Yep. Oh, it's a turtle? Yeah. You saw a big turtle down the road. He's a big heavy one. Yeah. Yep. You know that. That's exactly the only way you can pick them up. You will take your fingers off. Right? Yep. What are you going to do I'm going to get the hook out and then let him go. All right. Uh oh. Yeah, they do get big. Take a picture, Dora. I got them on my GoPro. Be extra careful. There he goes. Good job. Yeah, he's more scared than you are. Yeah. But anyway, yep. when I was a kid, I had one. We found one, and he was just. All right, this fowl hook this little. Bluegill. I hope I was recording. I think I was. That's good. Hey mom, are you kidding me? Another turtle? I think I'm just gonna quit fishing. Like really, these turtles are voracious here. This one isn't a snapping turtle, but oh my God. Like what is with these turtles? This is my skinny bear drop shot hook too. I'm not losing this. Ah, ready to slider. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna quit. After this, I'm done with these turtles. And my D hooker is no longer to be seen. Yeah, no more D hooker. I'm gonna have to use the scale. Scale time. I don't know if I got the snapping turtle on cam, but it's about a five pounder. Oh god. Which way is the hook shank? Oh my god. This is a stupid. Yeah, go. Hey, he came off. This turtle is nasty. Ready? One, two, three. Bye! That is so gross. So I am done. Alright. I'm done. I'm done. I don't know, man. I tried the chartreuse crankbait for a while. I don't know, parrot. This water's nice and blue, but... I am walking the wrong way. Anyways, today's summary is um two failed attempts over there. Um one snapping turtle and one red headed slider here and a bunch of little sunfish. And um yeah, I came in having a high ego. Um hoping that I'll just have a slay fest on that swim bait, but the weeds in the ponds were so bad. So I came over here, chartreuse Senko caught the uh, big turtle big snapper and the white mr. twister caught the little one along with the, all the other fish so 
I'm uh, wrapping it up for today. Not really much for the video, but I need a video up, so I'm gonna go ahead and post it. Um, school's in now, so I'm not gonna be doing that many much as much fishing as I used to. Uh, no dailies. I might do some dailies in the winter when I have bought some stuff and do unboxings, but it's not happening. So, again, guys, thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in the next episode.